Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be doing a, another review and this is on a company that I feel like a lot of people have heard about but weren't exactly sure. So I'm here to tell you about them. So the name of the company is Shop Miss A and honestly, honestly, I've only had good experiences with them and I'm here to tell you all about it so let's get on to the video. So Shopping is 8, first of all this video is not sponsored. All of these products are going to be reviewed in a very honest opinion. First and foremost everything that I'm going to be showing in this video I bought with my own money. This again it's not sponsored. I bought all of these because I felt like it, because I wanted to, because I just felt like it was appropriate. So I'm going to be giving my full honest review and honestly this company isn't bad. It's not bad and I'm really surprised that they exist. <laughs> so I bought from Shop Miss A about three times now. This has been my third order that I purchased from them and honestly I'm really surprised of how things always turn out when I, like whenever I receive it, whenever I test it out and I'm just always so shook. So basically Shop Miss A is a company that sells like makeup stuff, beauty products, um, accessories, <laughs> accessories, jewelries, all stuff within like a dollar and like a little bit more it's like a dollar store makeup but it's actually really good thing so a lot of times i bought like lip glosses i think i bought like one lipstick before deodorant and stuff like that and then i always wanted to so i first started out as a test run with like lip glosses lip balm and just to see exactly how these things are so you have to take note that when you do shop on shop miss a things are going to be a lot more smaller than you may have anticipated but then again it's for a dollar so I guess it makes sense but one thing for sure is like it fits me perfectly that way because I'm not the biggest makeup person so a lot of times I don't want to buy expensive makeup if I'm not going to use it all the time I'm not an everyday makeup wearer so shopping on Miss A has really helped me save a budget on when I didn't really need makeup things but I still kind of needed it and honestly honestly I'm really happy that this store exists I'm just going to quickly talk about actually uh, how my orders go because I do live in Canada, I'm not in the United States, and how much I usually get charged. So when you shop on Miss A and you're from Canada, things aren't going to be exactly a dollar. They're going to be like a dollar twenty-two cents or a dollar forty-two cents because, like you know, currency exchange. So even though it's not like a dollar for us Canadians, but it's still technically a dollar. So it's not really something I can complain about. Like, I still don't really understand the concept of how Miss A works because on their website it just explains like they're. Uh, first it started off with like the beauty manufacturers and then goes straight to Miss A and then there's like no marketing, no wholesale, no middleman so it keeps, it stays at one dollar. So I guess because it's from the basics and it stays the basics, that's why the makeups, like the makeup and all the other stuff's for a dollar. It's still a mystery to me. Um, I'm actually still trying to look more into this website, but they do mention that they're cruelty free. They do not test on animals, which I really, really appreciate. Some people are still skeptical about it because you can't find them on like the databases to check if a company is cruelty free or not. But then they do claim on their website, so I don't think they'll just put it on their website and then the company wouldn't like come out and say no you're not cruelty free Can you please remove this from your website so because it's still technically on their website i do believe that they are cruelty free if not someone please let me know please let me know and i will stop using the products immediately so the first time i ordered on shop miss a i ordered about 12 items and it came to a total of 22 dollars so that's not bad the second time i ordered on shop miss a i had a total of 40 dollars and i believe i did double did I do double? I think I ordered around like 20 things that time. That sounds about right. And then this time I ordered about 34, 35 items worth of things and it came up to like $50. So when I would order the things and then I got it and then I paid for it, it was all reasonably priced. I couldn't really complain much about it. The thing about it is the customs. The customs is always the main issue that I feel like us Canadians face with these companies and it's really annoying because I wish you'd have like stores like Shop Miss A in Canada so we didn't have to pay the extra for customs. So the first two times I've ordered from this company they did not hit me with the customs fee. They like placed my things in a mailbox I guess because it was small enough to go in the mailbox but then the third time so recently I ordered it was way bigger than <laughs> what I've ordered in the past so they hit me with the $15 customs fee and I would say maybe because it was so big like the past two times they haven't hit me with that and then all of a sudden they did I would say because of the size because when I saw it I was like oh that's mine dang that could be it 
that could be it so now we got all the money talk out of the way i can now present to you some things that i've been using from shop miss a and why i'm still very happy with this company so right off the bat here are some of the little things that i got the first like the first two orders or the first two orders yeah so what we have here is a brow gel this brow gel is in the color ebony so it's basically black because i got black brows my sister was like get some um dark brown i'm like no no i'm gonna stick with my black so this one is basically gel i don't have to put a large amount because it pr it's pretty pigmented so once i put it on my brows it just it works magnificent and I, I have actually, I don't use this one on the regular degular, I actually use, how do you pronounce this in English? I say pomade because I'm French, I don't know if in English you say pomade, pom pomade, whatever you, you English folks call it. So this pomade, I'm just going to say pomade in French because it's easier for me, it's uh, basically eyebrow pomade. Uh, in the color ebony as well this one as you can see i've been using ever since actually last year and i just put a little bit i just take like my eyebrow brush i'm gonna call it my eyebrow brush and i just gently put it on like the edge of my eyebrows because my eyebrows are pretty filled like over here but like at the end kind of like fades out so that's when i would put some at the end of it and then i cleaned it up and it looks very very nice it's very pigmented as well i don't need to use a large amount which is why i still have so much left it's kind of crazy um but yeah so and then the other thing that we have here is just like a mango lip balm you know if my lips be dry and i can't find my other lip balms i'd be using this one it lasts on my lips for a very long time and doesn't leave like a residue or anything it's actually just really nice next we have is this fat lash i <laughs> mascara i mascara mascara Ooh. so it goes on very very nicely it separates my eyelashes very very nicely as well yeah y'all i'm not a beauty guru but like if i need to like glam myself up to look nice to go somewhere i will do it next what we have here is something really really cool it's this like wine bottle shape lip gloss lip cream matte soft the color is actually really really nice but the thing about it is it's kind of red like on my lips i was hoping for a more neutral tone but like once you like kind of just open it you know really cute aw number seven if you're ever on the website and you want this color it's all number seven it, it's like a very very light pink thing i thought it was going to be a little bit more neutral um it really wasn't i mostly put like these kind of shades of lip gloss or like lip cream or whatever lipstick i don't really wear lipstick at the bottom part of my lip just because that's the lightest and then if i put it at the top it looks weird so i only put like the light colors like this kind of pink at the bottom it doesn't look bad it doesn't look bad it can look worse I just think it's a little bit too much so sometimes i have to like mix it up with like a lip gloss so it kind of blends in so there's that so yeah that's the color it it's not the best i know don't don't come for me i got a new one though i got a new color and it's a lot more neutral so i'm going to show you that soon so next we have is this lip duo um lipstick with lip gloss it's very very self-explanatory it's like a lipstick and a lip gloss i don't put lipstick i don't put lipstick i literally just put like lip gloss but if i feel like my lips are looking really bad today and i want to cover it up i would use this and then just like so i would put like the lipstick and then i screw off the bottom and then i would apply the lip gloss that comes with it yo i am not a, a beauty guru i'm not doing myself justice right now i'm telling you i know how to dress myself i know how to put myself together but for some reason today it's just not working out so those are basically majority of the first items i like officially got from the website and after that i was like you know i'm gonna get something from them like I'm, I'm probably gonna make like one more big order for like the final time because i don't really need a lot of makeup items at the moment and that was this order so now i'm going to be doing an unboxing in front of you so you can see exactly um how these things are so let's get to it now the first thing that i'm going to mention that i forgot to mention i got this in the past were these deodorant wipes i got this the first the second time on shop miss a 
and ever since then I've been obsessed once I got these deodorant wipes I was like I need to get some more because I try to find them in like stores but they're so expensive for what reason I don't know so that's when I did my order with shop miss a again um there's a third one and I got three so I'm fully stocked. So there's like a regular one and then one for like activity, sports, you know, physical activity if you're really, really moving like that. So I got like three in total, two of the regular, one of like the sports kind. And it comes with aloe vera, which is very good and hydrating for the skin. So I really, really love that. And I'm fully stocked up and I won't need to buy from them for another year. So thank you. Shop this A for blessing me it was such a creation. Oh my gosh. So I tend to buy a lot of like lip things on Shop this A just because just because. At first I did actually get this um lip pop lip gloss in another color but then it turned out to be too light for me so i gave it to my sister and it was perfect on her so i was like okay if this one's a little bit too light let me go for the second darkest for it and it was called city girl and then i just kind of like lightly put it on yo it's like super neutral it's exactly the color i needed and it makes my skin look poppin'. So the next item is another lip product and it's basically a lip mask in the flavor coconut. And it's one of those where you're like, especially in the winter time when your lips are always so dry and no matter what you do, they just keep coming out dry. I tried putting on Blistex, I tried putting on Vaseline and sometimes things aren't just enough. And then I read that getting a lip mask helps to hydrate your lips again so right now it's summertime so my lips aren't as dry as before but the next time my lips are dry i'm definitely going to be using this to test it out another thing that i got today was this liquid con concealer 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 this liquid concealer in the color nutmeg now when it comes to me trying to like match things that are like my color i'm always pretty spot on so this time me and my sister were like let me just grab two because i wasn't sure i got the color amber and nutmeg nutmeg is more of my type and i basically wanted to have something in case you know you can you just sometimes you just need these things in case so let me just show you exactly how it would look like on but the more i go in i tried it out with my i tried it out with my sister she was the one correcting me and such so i'm learning from her i'm learning from her she's a real beauty guru not i so let me just finish with that and boom like what okay so i definitely used the wrong brush i'm sorry um i have a bunch of brushes in my makeup bag right now but i just didn't know which one to take out so this one was already out this is the one i always use so i was like let me just use it i'm sorry if it wasn't the right one Feel free to send to me in the comments because this you already know this is not a beauty channel. This is not a beauty channel. So as you can see, it actually blended in very nicely, very quickly. And I guess my color now is nutmeg. And then I guess I can just put like some light powder or foundation on top. Something else that I got from them is this exfoliating bath cloth. And again, let me show you how it says. It's a dollar right there. So... This company is, at first I was skeptical about them, I'm not even going to lie, but then there wasn't much to be skeptical about because I'm getting decent quality products for a dollar and you know, it is what it is. So this is like a bath cloth, you can use it to exfoliate your skin while you're taking a bath. You can also use it to wash your back, which I really, really need because um, it's so hard to wash like a back if you don't have the proper like things for it you can always read reviews on the website as well people are honest when it's needed um they would say if the color was just not for them but the quality was good sometimes they might mention like there's a chemical smell i find the reviews on the website very very honest it's pretty straightforward and it's not like they're bots they're not bots there's one stars there's two stars three four and five stars because people have different experiences with these stuff and people just want to share their opinions so others know as well something else that I got uh, this time are invisible acne patches you know in case it's like very bad acne days or just like one out of the blue and you have to go somewhere the next day acne patch so this was like a dollar 22 42 cents and then this comes in a pack of 15 so 
that's cool something else about like the website is they do have like a lot of DIY things and one of the things is like DIY candles so I got some candle wicks because I've been pretty obsessed with candles the past couple of months and I kind of just wanted to start making my own just to see if it would work so something else I wanted to get that my sister was like it's not gonna work it's not gonna work is this mosquito repellent it's a really cute design too like look at that so if you watched my last video, you saw that we went to like the woods, we went to Warden Woods for like a nice hike or a walk and as always, there's always so many bugs and then I was like, yo, yo, I need, I need to wait for my mosquito thing for the next time we go on one of these walks. So then it came in today and I was like to Raleigh, I'm ready for our walk today or our walk whenever we're going to go again you should totally watch the video it's actually really really funny i promise you it's actually funny so basically you can like clip it on like your bag your clothes anywhere that she just wants to help avoid like mosquitoes and i feel like just bugs majority from like coming into close contact with you so i had to get one if this works i might have to order a bunch more the next time i order from them because this is going to save me from so much so another thing that I got here that I'm excited to try out but I'm kind of surprised that it's in a plastic bag is this eye cream so when I saw it on the website I was expecting to get this thing but instead they printed that onto this thing so so I'm like reading it and it says to pour the contents into a reusable jar or bottle before use. After cleansing the skin, apply a small amount to finger and apply gently pat and massage around the contour of the eye. So they want me to put this... Why can't y'all just give me this... You know... It's fine. Another thing I got here is a rat tail comb edge brush thing so as you can see it has like the rat tail at the bottom and then like the brush and like the comb it's a lot bigger actually you see this it's like compared to the one that my sister has which is way smaller this is perfect for like I guess like laying down my wig especially I can now pr probably part my wigs and like everything so yeah I got this in color white to be different so the next thing I got here is a shea butter hand lotion just because I can't find my old hand lotion it went missing I never found it after a couple months ago but then I was like I'm gonna need it because school's starting again soon and I don't want to walk around with ashy hands so this is basically just like a hand cream my hands feel great that's all I can say <laughs> because I love to take care of my nails my nails tend to grow very very fast I just love my natural nails in general right now I had to cut them because they're growing uneven but they grow pretty fast and pretty strong so to help them with their growth I decided to get a cuticle repair cream thing nail and cuticle repair cream okay so I guess so this is what I'm going to have to do so if you can see I just have to turn this clockwise and then as you can see here, this is basically the oil which is going to reach the top of the pen. So I'm just going to, should I probably, there we go, there we go. So it reached the top, I didn't even notice, but as you can see, I like to enhance like the natural things in my body, like uh, my eyelashes, the skin, the lips. I just try to find makeup that's like neutral enough to still help like enhance what I already have. So being able to help enhance my nails is going to be fantastic. You can tell that there's the oil. It's all shiny and glossy and oily because it's an oil paint for your cuticles and nails. So that's that. So this last thing that we have here is a setting spray, an oil control setting spray. Um, this one was like $1.88, so it was around $2 Canadian. And it's basically a setting spray for makeup. Um, so if I'm ever going to do like my makeup, like actually have like a full face of foundation because I'm just having a very bad skin day or something. And then I just want to keep the powder in lock or the, the foundation, whatever I try to do that day. I don't know my future self. I guess I'm just going to do a couple of sprays. And I've heard a lot of good things about it. My mom has tried it. She's really liked the results as well. from Because we purchased this the first time. And then I was like, let me just have it for myself in case, you know? So I have that. It's basically just like oil control setting spray, locks and makeup, post makeup application. And yeah, 
a lot of these have like good ingredients inside like the key ingredients in this is lotus flower extract aloe extract and hydrolyzed collagen is that how you pronounce it I you don't know but it sounds good it sounds good I'm gonna tell you that it sounds really good <laughs> so that's basically the end of this video I'm so sorry this video was all over the place I was just really excited to show off the things I got from this website and I don't really like to highly encourage people to do stuff so, because then if something doesn't like if something doesn't go accordingly then I'm going to feel responsible but if you would like to check out this website I will be putting the link in the description they're called shop miss a again this is not sponsored I bought all this with my own money I won't be buying again from them for maybe another year because these things kind of just last me because I don't do my makeup every day I don't use like I'm not a makeup everyday kind of person this is just like there in case of like an inconvenience if something's just like on my face and I need to cover it up real quick and just like to help enhance like my natural beauty and stuff like that you know naturally beautiful but I try honestly I'm having a blast just like making these videos for y'all I'm having a blast talking to y'all hearing about your experiences um just being happy you found my channel and just having a good time because this is all we're here for so I'm done talking I'm sorry I took in so long of your time but thank you so much for watching till the end and I will see y'all in the next video bye guys